the guy that I'm going to check, I've dealt with him a few times in the last few years over some issues. If I were to get the trap pretending the trap, then I've got him dead to rights. Tomorrow morning, I'll come back and sit on this and play the waiting game. Warden Curtis returns the following morning to catch the lawbreaker. Right now, I'm just kind of hanging tight, waiting to see if he comes. You've got to check your, your foothold type traps, your coyote traps, every 24 hours. And it's been well past that now. Uh, so that's a criminal violation, not to mention the trespass violation, which is another criminal violation. So there's two to start with. And, and uh, whether there's more when he gets here or not, we'll, we'll have to wait and see. Sometimes high-tech trail cameras and fluorescent dye aren't enough to catch the bad guys. So wardens must resort to tried and true methods, like a good hiding spot, a keen eye, and lots of patience. Eight hours later. You know, my favorite thing about doing this sort of work is the unexpected. That's what keeps you doing it. You know, it can be long, long, boring hours, but you know, that few seconds of catching somebody in the act is all worth it. Curtis finally hears a truck in the distance. Let's see if it's gonna come down the road. Pretty fast. Oh, that's him. Good deal. It belongs to the trapper he's been after for a long time. He's stopping. Shh, shh. I'm gonna reset. He's resetting his trap. All right. Game work. Oh, a whole lot. Have you got your license on you real quick? The trapper knows that Curtis has him dead to rights for not tending his traps. Yeah, I was not me yesterday, I know. Yeah, OK. When was the last time you were up? Friday yeah. the other day. Yeah, but I, uh, I've been working on traps and stuff. Uh, the, the bigger issue with this one is, do you know who owns this land? You probably know what I got to do. OK, um, I got to write you a ticket for the no permission and for the not tendon. I told my wife you'd be waiting for me today. He knew. We've played this game many times. He's not new to not playing by the rules all the time. I'm going to write him a summons for the failure to tend and the trespass. Persistence pays off. We've been here well over 24 hours. We need to make sure everybody follows the laws, follows the rules of trapping. And when they don't, we need to make sure we hold them accountable 